you can sleep in the night and not know that that is the last time you will sleep in that realm Hi. if joseph knew if joseph knew all the people in the prison would have cleaned his shoe and said oh God, it is within your bail me imagine the guy that bought joseph when he was shaving joseph little did he know he would have earned himself a position forever imagine those who were with the pre in the prison with obas and john the night he will come out if they had known that he would just come out never to return they would have said augusta let's pray father bless this man so that at least he will remember them beware of people that you keep mocking and say you are not this you can't speak english very well you can't do this and that and that beware let me tell you you know why because if you are not if you don't take time welcome to start now channel we are glad you tuned in today to experience another life-changing encounter in god's presence the bible says in psalm 119 verses 130 the entrance of thy word is it life as you listen and watch may you experience the transformative power of god's life ecclesiastes 9 11 verse 11 did i say one 11 please verse 11 everybody please read i returned and saw under the that the race is not to the swift nor the battle to the strong neither yet bread to the wise nor yet riches to men of understanding nor yet favor to men of skill this is the mystery we're about to discuss now everybody read it but time and chance i want to show you the mystery of greatness listen repeat this last clause again one to go time one more time but time and chance happens to who how many everybody now replace the word chance where are we now okay but time and chance replace the word chance with opportunity are you ready now one to read i want you to replace the word time with the word seasons are you ready now one to read but seasons and opportunities happen to them all but seasons like the hand of a clock it has been designed by the sovereign act of God that for every man upon the surface of the earth there is the turning of the hand of the clock and that one day time and opportunity will always happen to them ah. Holy Spirit The Bible says it happens to some, happens to everybody. That means there is a guarantee. Please listen, somebody's deliverance is coming. There is a guarantee based on the word of God that a day must come if God is God, where time and chance. You know how they do cooperative society. Five of us bring 20, 20,000. It's now your own turn it's now your own turn and i start smiling although it's not my turn because i know that my turn is coming for sure and the bible says time and chance so in the equation of greatness we are bringing the constant factors and then we work on the variables we are doing a little mathematics here are you getting my point it says time and chance this one no devil can stop it no harbor is from your village you don't need to pray about it he said time if you are under the sun time and chance happen to them ah i show you a mystery ah so time that means a time will come in my life whether i'm prepared or not whether i pray for it or not whether i fast for it or not a time will come where the hand of God will navigate opportunities 
whether i see it or not is irrelevant god's justice must be done therefore the bible for once us is a redeeming time now that you know that a day will come this is where a lot of people miss it we keep focusing on looking at the day the bible says it will come remove that in the equation of your preparation for greatness and begin to focus on taking advantage of that day it will come the equation of greatness let's look at um okay greatness therefore in the kingdom comes by number one god matching seasons and opportunities together and then number two you finding favor by securing that opportunity i'm going to explain myself let me have somebody please okay everyone come hallelujah watch this let's assume this is spiritual timing and according to god's justice system okay stand here Aaron. Please. that this time is going to keep moving are you seeing it now and that a day will come it may take a long time but that a day is going to come when it will come to aaron and if aaron misses on that opportunity it will keep moving again are you getting what i'm saying that's why if god wants to help you in life he restores yes not what you lost yes he tries to bring back the time so that the mistake you made you can remedy it he never said i will restore the goods because they are not necessary once there is time and those seasons is somebody understanding what i'm saying now the problem with the body of christ is that we all sit down being distracted at looking at the clock and waiting for the day it gets to our turn rather than getting busy to sharpen that ability so that the day the time comes you will enter the presence of greatness once and never come out again forever every man in the scripture that became great waited for that kairos moment joseph was in the prison but he knew there is an ability to interpret dreams it's only a matter of time the brother sold him he said no problem pharaoh's wife lied that he wanted to rape her no problem they threw him in the prison but when the season comes that part of the equation is god that starts moving that's favor with god are you seeing that now god made it in such a way that the wine presser had to do something wrong to go to the prison so while he was in the prison the divine transaction started happening and the wine presser came out although the wine presser forgot about him but a day came let me tell you it does not take two days for you to enter greatness read the bible it always happened in one day there is always a day called one day he said john remained in the wilderness until his season of appearing there is, john was sharpening himself in the wilderness when the season came he came out and he completed his assignment one time jesus for 30 years was preparing for a season of three years 30 years read all the books knew all the law did everything and there was flawless victory within three and a half years so there are many of us sitting down looking at people's cars and say man i like this jeep goodness bmw this and that ford explorer 2014 limited edition look at that foolishness we are there claiming i claim it time and chance your turn is soon coming create an urgency sharpen the knife sharpen the anointing sharpen the healing anointing one day see let me tell you you may say there are many people the bible says in israel there were many widows but to none was the prophet sent god will send people specifically to you ah, and when you take advantage of that season that is it 
you are open to a dimension of grace i have studied almost every great ministry i admire and i found out that in the history of that ministry something always happened something happened at the kairos season and the men plunged into it with revelation and boom never to return again are you are you getting what i'm sharing with you ah i feel the anointing of the spirit if you sit down and you are wondering kai this house one day we are coming when will this come no 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 you never see me bother you insult yourself when you do that many young people here our dream is car right car let me buy car and you are trying to save how much can you save for the car you want i'm teaching you a higher law get out of all those 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 ways of frustration and misery that's why many people cannot give god glory they suffer for everything in their life come and adopt the kingdom's way there is a higher dimension there is a higher way believe me look let me tell you i'm a businessman i've read many business books so don't you think i'm just talking nonsense i know what i'm saying hallelujah when that kairos moment comes in your life when it comes in your ministry some people are snoring through the night the time will pass they wake up and an opportunity that took 10 years has just passed before it will come back again the first son is graduating from the university he has not learned his lesson after 25 years it comes again prophecy comes in the name of Jesus let restoration happen and by the mercy of God the time is reversed it comes again the same lack of preparation keeps bringing people down are you seeing why it takes more than receive it to walk in this land you would thank me in the future for what i'm teaching you i'm teaching you the way to a superior life so that you stop blaming your parents and say if my father only accepted this job stupid man would have been out of this uh -uh, leave your father alone god is bringing you to a point i don't care what degree you graduated with I don't care there is a problem listen if you solve a millionaire's problem you have access to his millions it's as simple as that You'll never be a failure in this life never so every time I spend in prayer I'm sharpening my giftings for that day a day will come when that season comes God will send a great man who can sow a seed of 100 million naira to Koinonia. The person will be dying of tuberculosis or something. It's like that. That's how it works. There is always something you can exchange for. And God will make it in such a way that on the day he's coming, somebody will be bringing Koinonia messages. That one is God's part of the equation. While that is happening, I'm praying in the secret place. Shekata baba baba. Rakata bada. Greater wisdom, oh God. You can sleep in the night and not know that that is the last time you will sleep in that realm. Hi. If Joseph knew, if Joseph knew, all the people in the prison would have cleaned his shoe and said, Oga, okay, it is within your bail me. Imagine the guy that bought Joseph. When he was shaving Joseph, little did he know he would have earned himself a position forever. Imagine those who were with the pre in the prison with Obasanjo, the night he would come out. If they had known that he would just come out never to return they would have said augusta let's pray father bless this man so that at least he will remember them beware of people that you keep mocking and say you are not this you can't speak english very well you can't do this and that and that beware let me tell you you know why because if you are not if you don't take time please look at me let's just focus god is just doing this thing if if you are if you don't pay attention can i tell you the truth a day will come you will find out that the same person you saw today you looked at her said mary what is there you will open an office that you feel from for two weeks there are people today who are angry with me they are angry with me because there were times when we could access one another 
and at those times they could say a lot of things call me when they wanted but i was doing something they were not doing we were all laughing and joking and today because of the difficulty in reaching me they pick offense it's not my fault i refuse to remain at that level i intend to grow be nice to people today let me tell you brothers and sisters for those of you who look at people in koinonia and when we say greet one another you just turn you don't know who you are turning time and chance he may come from a poor family he may have one ton sanders but let me tell you time the word you are sharing is sharpening you for that time a day will come there is something god has put in you this is the justice of god this is why every man can be great time and chance happens to them all the day it happened to our parents they were not prepared they were there talking about others criticizing others and the clock passed and it went to one drunkard who just got born again and saw the time took advantage of it and they said ah, is this not the boy on campus that was drinking he was drinking but he did something with his opportunity now he's a billionaire he's a pastor he's advancing the kingdom we believe you were blessed by the message you just watched let us know what stood out to you in the comment section. You can also support our channel by liking and sharing our videos. So more people like you will be able to watch these powerful messages. We celebrate you and see you in our next video. Thank you.